Right, I'm now going to show you how to load the old boat up and show you a little mix that I use to catch quite a few of my fish. All right, we've got the rig. Bloody hell, do you hear that? He wants it. All right, I've got the rig. All right, I'm now going to get ready to put it in the boat. I've got a dissolvable nugget, all right, which you can buy in the shops, and it looks after your hook, keeps all the rig nice and straight and the rig morale on it. All right, and then... What I do is I put it into the boat, clip it up on the side, all right, that's it. That's ready to go. I'm now going to show you we're going into the mix, all right? Do -do 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 -do. Into the mix, man. Right, first in the mix, maggots, gooty lalas. That's what, call them whatever you want. Magua, togum. Do you know what togum is? Maggots backwards. Right, look, in it goes. A few little bits and bobs of the old goatee lalas, right? Then, a little bit of the old response pellet. Ooh -hee, in that goes, right? And then, what I do is, I get a few little boilies, right? And plop them in over the top of it, right? Because I don't want to put the boilies, right, so that they run around. I want them to come out of that tube and just go straight down over my hook boat. Right, last but not least, I always do it this way, man. Don't ask me why, always have, always will. But the maggots should always go at the bottom. Because if you put the maggots at the top, right, put them in the boat, they wiggle out. And by the time they get out there, you've got no maggots left in the tube. Right, so, right, here we go. Little bit of the old, uh, I'll give it a little plug for the boys. Look, bit of bait zone, right? That's their spod and particle mix. Right, put a little dunk of that in at the top of it. Right, and away we go. Bob's your uncle, fan is your arm. Right, that's it, you know what I mean? So we've got no spillage on the way out, because the last thing you want is spillage. When you're driving the boat out and you're driving it in a straight line, what happens? You get all little bits drop on it all night long. You're going, doo, 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 doo. it's like going to the bloody disco. Alright, so we put that in there, I clip that tube on. I made this out of them PVA tubes, drill a few holes in it and whatever, plop it in there. Then it, guess what? Get ready, ready for the launch. Du, 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 du. Ready for the launch. HMS Liberty. This is called Liberty. Why? Because at times you can take liberties with it. So there you go. Right, turn him on, turn him on. Watch the little button to make sure that you don't open that door. Little bum door. Right, and in we go. Prime the little bugger up. And off we go, come on. That's it. Well, hey, where the monkeys? Out she goes. Come on. Get ready for the launch. Bombs away. That'll do nicely. Let's have it. Little, and back she comes. Back on the rest. Liberty's on her way back. That'll do for me.